writer Megan Greasy here's a look at the Thursday, March 13th edition of the Herald Press. Huntington City Mayor Brooks Vetter spoke of the seven-year annexation plan for the city at the for the city at the Huntington City Common Council meeting Tuesday evening. No action was taken taken at the meeting, but Vetter's told the council and around 60 people in attendance about the plan, which included annexing five different areas outside of the city, starting as early as this year and ending in 2012. For more on that uh, story or and a map of the areas that are proposed for annexation, uh, check out the Herald Press tomorrow or check out the website uh, now. Um, also in tomorrow's paper, um, look at the the, the blessings in a backpack program, which provides um, meals and snacks to students on the free and reduced lunch program. Uh, had a fundraiser last night, um, Tuesday night, excuse me, at. Um, Yes, Tuesday was last night. Forgetting what day it is. Um, Tuesday at um, it, it was a dance fish fry, and they just used it. They said they had a really good turnout, better than they expected, and all the money is going back to the program. Um, also, we take a look at the crazy winter storm that blew in today. Uh, dropped quite a few inches of snow, and just it canceled school, which means they're going to extend the uh, one hour, um, the hour longer school day an extra week and um, they also we also talked to a few officials about the concerns about flooding because it's supposed to warm up again and you know they dumped several inches of snow so but officials said they were would be keeping an eye out on that also in tomorrow's paper a team comprised of Huntington University marketing students is in the final round of the Indiana Department of Agriculture's promoting the good works of Indiana agriculture contest and it is the only school from Northeast Indiana to be there so congratulations to them on getting in the top three and good luck in the final. Um, let's see, tomorrow's the food page, so you should keep an eye out for the Amish Cook and the American Institute for Cancer Research column. Um, that one is, excuse me, it's interesting um, tomorrow because it deals with, um, some of the ingredients include buffalo, and it's a Mora Moroccan uh, tagine, or however you pronounce it, which I've had before and they're very good, so um, check it out. Let's see, in sports, we take a look at Huntington University preparing, um, the women's team preparing to uh, meet up against Menlo College in the NAIA tournament uh, that takes place at 1 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time on Thursday. Um, it's in Central Time because it's in Iowa, but you'll be able to view it, or it'll take place at 1 p.m. our time here. So, best of luck to the Foresters. The men play tonight, I believe. So. Best of luck to both those teams, and uh, good luck in the tournament. That's a quick look at the Herald Press for Thursday. We invite you to pick up a copy and read more, or you can also read more on our website at h-pconline.com. Thank you, and have a great day.